quarters. No way I'd be able to swim. Up ahead, girl. See the valve? Time to put our hands to use. I'll take care of this one. There's another valve on the other side to lock the gate in place. Would you mind heading across and uh, doing the honors? You know, I'm reminded of a delve I undertook out near the planet. Stone room, cloud cone, whiskey. I've been 13 levels. Monstrosity, but no walls. Just great stone columns bearing the way to the level above. Filled out with row upon row of those enormous rusted out old world carts. You know the ones uh, with the four wheels? I've scraped through a hundred of those carts. The only things I've ever seen inside are bird nests. You don't suppose that's what they were for, do you? Where was the old one once? of stagnant water. Charming. Marvelous! You made it! Now grab that valve and give it a spin! On it. A little more now and I should be able to get the blasted gate moving! You should be able to lower the gate. Huh? Right you are! Now, when I get this gate down, you'll need to turn the valve again. Ought to lock this thing in place. One gate down. Halfway through then, aren't we? To the second gate! A ladder is a rare and special thing, girl. Can depend on it to take you exactly where you need to go, and no further. Hmm. I'd wager the valves for the second sluice gate are somewhere above us. How are we gonna get up there? Let me look around, see what I can find. It looks like I could jump across on that... like the western platform. Let me find a way up. Swim against it. It's even less refreshing than it looks. Nice jump. <laughs> nice. What am I saying? That was stupendous! I've never seen such an absolute space. disregard for personal safety! Thanks, I think. I mean, 
Far be it for me to tell you how to fling yourself up. Huh? You're right above me. Just send that ladder on down. Look out below. Now we've done this once before. Should be as easy as falling down a hole. If you take the valve on the other side. I set up the same way on this side. I should look for an access tunnel. This, this is my sort of delve. A thousand little problems to solve. The reason my reason is to go back. Uh-huh, Gildan. Okay, Gildan, turn the valve! Too heavy. Glance behind me, would you? See anything big and uh, broken? Looks like part of the counterweight broke off. If I can get up there, my weight might be enough to get it moving again. Uh, hang on, okay? I've got a plan. I need to get up higher. I would climb up that wreckage. That's pretty much what I do.
the uh, ring. Maybe if you pry its jaws open and reach inside, I can't look. to run my boots dry. You were right. This thing did swallow the ring. Ha! <laughs> ha! That's the old gilded intuition in action. It's never led me astray. Sure, its chosen routes can be a bit circuitous, but... Never mind. To the storage room. To the spoils! Ooh, what's in here? More old world treasures, perhaps? This place is full of surprises. Should we have a look? Didn't you want to get into the storage room? I do enough water fervently for to do, but, but well, I wonder if I could. I got time to poke my nose in if you did. Maybe I can drain the rest of the water from here. Sure are a lot of valves. I should check my focus first. I could check my focus, see what it sees. All right, time to get the flow going to the right place. I say this as a man typically enamored of complexities, but this looks like it might be a little much for me. Don't worry, I think I've got this. Music to my ears, to each job its proper tool. Toothpicks make horrible arrows, as the saying goes. Oh, help. The water can't pass through. You got a competent mind, girl. A mind for nuance and finesse. Not I. No, indeed. Not old Gildan. This job demands a certain degree of patience, doesn't it? I'm afraid I inherited my mother's restlessness. Been at this a while, girl. No room to judge, mine. I once spent half a day flummoxed by a carja puzzle box. <laughs> That's not quite right. Um... There, that should do it. I should head back. I still have to get this. Got it working, did you? <laughs> of course you did. Never met a conundrum you couldn't unconundrum, have you? The door's open. And it's sealed because of the flame. Smells like a forge side morning in the claim. Looks like that's everything. I should head back up with Gildan. Like, 
Like, what about after the... Oh, sorry. Just a sec. Laura? I, uh... I need to take a break. Laura? Hey! Laura! As we circle back around to the matter of the supply room. I can't wait, I can't wait, I can't wait! Almost there! Soon I'll hold the looking glass in my hand. Just like Mom and I used to. Lock positions. Helpful. Uh, what? Um, what are you doing with your hands there, girl? <laughs> I can't believe that worked. I thought you'd lost your mind tickling the empty air like that. Gildan? Everything okay? I was so sure I saw it. The looking glass. I was so sure. Right there in the window. I was... Of course. Trick of the light. Nothing at all. I'm sorry, Gildan. It must have meant a lot to you. Oh, well. Much as any artifact of the old ones would mean to me, really. It's fine. Uh, I'm fine. Besides, what are the spoils compared to the Delve? That's why we do it, girl. <laughs> the Delve! Not the treasure. <laughs> and what a Delve it was! Ugh! By the Great Blazing Forge, I'll never forget that. Now then, I, uh, believe we have some repairs to make. I'd have to ditch something. Okay, let's fix the panel and shut this place down. Oh, that. 
That's a whole lot prettier, isn't it? <laughs> what does it mean? By the forge! <laughs> you are a wonder! Do you hear that often? I'll hazard a guess you do. I've heard something like that once or twice. Oh, she's modest now. A master of the arts of the old ones, a delver to shame the entire claim, and she wants to be modest. Ha! It's not like I did it alone, Gildan. No. No, I suppose not. So what's next for you? On your way back to the claim? And deprive the people of Song's Edge the story of this encounter? Perish the thought! <laughs> I'll stay there a while longer. But a story is best told by all who encountered it. Come and lend a hand, won't you? <sighs> Accessible. Minimal flood damage. Sounds like the basin is dried out, too. Maybe I'll take a look. Another adventure so soon? <laughs> You're braver than me. But there was no question of that. <laughs> and right here in Bask in our victory for a while. And going by that sound, I think Lala is already at the door. few minutes anyway. Live from the illustrious Overflow Basin Studios, it's Concrete Beach Party! A one, a two, a one, two, three, four!
You look happy to be playing again. I don't know what you did, but the water drained in the snap of a short song. What do you think of the music? I've never heard anything else like it. That's because there's no other place with such resonance, such intonation that rattles your ribs with its power. And of course, no one else knows these pipes like I do. I learned them by ear before I could walk, strapped to my father's back. Thank you for draining the waters. Not just for myself, but for my ancestors and their songs. Please, take this as a token of our gratitude. Let's see. Watch whetstone. The sound is warmer. Must be the entrance to this den.